Need a horse? Talk to my father, Skolbar. Well, hello. There's a nip in the air. Cold won't be. Honest pay for honest work. You should buy some produce from Carlotta's stall. Halt! City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. What? You think you can stand against the entire White Run City Guard? The gate's closed. Fine. But we'll be keeping an eye on you. Pay whatever it takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order that size on my own. Why don't you swallow that stubborn pride of yours and ask Yorland Greymane for help? <laughs> I'd sooner bend my knee to Ulfric's Stormcloak. Besides, Greymane would never make steel for the Legion. Have it your way. I'll take the job, but don't expect a miracle. Got some good pieces out here if you're looking to buy. More inside. Yes, actually. How about you smith me an iron dagger? Here's everything you need to make one. Go ahead. Take a look. Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. That's a decent weapon you've made there. I don't claim to be the best. Not bad, but it's a little dull. How about you sharpen it up? Just need a bit of metal and the grindstone over there. Mm-hmm. And my father. I help my father and more. This looks good. You put time into your blades, they'll serve you well when you need them. You want to keep helping? How about you make some armor? Let's start by tanning some leather on the rack. I'll take my leave then. You think all the... Ah, good. A lot of weapons and armor need leather for straps fitting. That kind of thing. Let's see if you can make a hide helmet. Here's the rest of what you need. Don't forget to check it.
Yes? I should hire you to be my assistant at this rate. Let's improve the fit. Take this leather to the workbench over there. I'll take my leave then. Out with it. Have you met my father? He's a steward up at Dragon's Reach. I help my father in more ways. Out with it. You have talent. Keep working at your craft and you'll be a fine smith one day. Why don't you keep that dagger and helmet? Maybe you will remember me when you're making Skyforge steel, huh? All right, then. Got some good piece. Hmm, blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Ulfred, patron of the great clan Battleborn, a name I'm sure you know well. Uncivilized pelt-wearing axe-draggers. It's a wonder they don't still live in a cave like those ancestors they keep boasting about. It's true, the Vignar Greymane and his lot are one of Whiterun's oldest and, depending on who you ask, most respected clans. I don't dispute that, but it's one thing to take pride in your lineage, and another to cling blindly to the past. What they call honor and tradition, I call ignorance. Money, you laggard, what else? It always comes down to coin. The Grey Manes have deep roots in Whiterun, but so do we. Difference is, we're rich. <laughs> And Vignar hates it. Oh, and they hate it too. All their big talk of pride and honor. What have they got to show for it? Beggars' rags and stale bread. We've got the same pride, same honor, and we've got wealth. No wonder they envy us. Metalborn is a name out of legend. Sung in the songs of old and heard in deeds of valor for a hundred generations. For clan battleborn they cry in the mead halls. First into the fray, and last to quit their ale. We've got honor, wealth, and titles too. Aye, and buxom women to warm your bed on a cold Skyrim night. Now if that don't answer your question, then no words will. Watch yourself out there. Ah, hello, my Nord friend. In the market for some hunting supplies? Yes, I hear that question often. 
My brother Anorieth and I came up with it one night after consuming rather too much mead. After our drinks, we went out for a moonlight hunt. We got separated, and in his drunken state, my brother mistook me for a deer. He shot an arrow that pierced my... well, rump. After such a memorable adventure, we knew we had the name for our shop. Try Holda, the innkeeper at the Bannered Mare. It's just up the road near the market. You should check in at Dragon's Reach, too. There's so much going on these days. The Jarl or his steward might have need of help. An archer, eh? I've got just what you need. Thank you very much for your business. Blade and shadow, silence and death. These are my arts. For a modest fee, I'll make great art for you. I am an artisan, painting in strokes of blood red upon the canvas of life. But yes, I will take coin to fight at your side. After all, where is the value in creating art if there is nobody left alive to see it? If you change your mind, seek me out here. Walk always in shadows so that you will see your foe. I work for Bellathor at the General Goods Store. Come by Bellathor's shop at the market. I'm sure we've got something you need. Don't mean to be rude, but I'm too busy to talk right now. Bits and baubles for sale, all crafted by the best blacksmith in Sky. <laughs> I can tell you're new around here asking a question like that. My husband, Eorland, tends the Skyforge up at Yorvaskar. The Companion's Mead Hall. Oh, there's no finer smith. You should ask him about his work. It's the only... Well, that and maybe those stuck-up, dung-sniffing... Don't even get me started on that. Huh. They put Shops on airs like there's something special. Oh, sure, they've got money, but they ain't got a shred of honor between them. Gray Mane. Huh. Now that's a name fills you with pride. We've got roots in White Run. We've got history. Tired of bread and stew? Had enough of fish and fowl? Treat yourself and your kin to a choice cut of steak or a tender rack of ribs? Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. You take care of yourself now. Once I've made enough money trading with the Khajiit caravans, I'm going to buy the Bannered Mare from Hulda. Chops and steaks fit for a yarl. Before my ma and da passed, 
I told them that one day, I'd become the best trader in Skyrim. I met one of the caravan leaders, Madron. He said he'd help me get started if I could bring him a mammoth's tusk. Easier said than done. You do that? If you find one, I could teach you a thing or two about trading. Help you get a fair bargain in the future? About the same as everyone else? They're the catfolk of elsewhere. Great warriors, good traders. The way I hear it, elsewhere ain't nothing like Skyrim. It's got tropical forests and dusty badlands. It sounds awful. Yeah, these Khajiit make a living traveling the roads and selling their wares. It's got to be tough. Skyrim's a hard enough land when you've got a roof over your head. Worst thing is, nobody wants them in the cities. Nobody trusts them. Reputation, mostly. A lot of Khajiit turn to smuggling and thievery to get by. A few bad apples spoil the bunch. You know how it is. Farewell. The finest cuts, fresh from the wilds. Oh yes, hunting is my great passion. That's why my brother and I opened a shop to sell hunting supplies. It's the drunken huntsman down by the main gate. He tends the store, and I've got this stall. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Good hunting. What's the matter? You can't stand the sight of a strong Nord woman? Wait. I know. I know. Looking for my husband, Nazi? What the? Check the Jarl's It took me weeks to find that thief's den. I can't stop now. And I can't. You tried mercenary work? My sapphire doesn't like that I've been spending so much time looking for my father's old sword. He fed his entire family with the gold he made using that weapon. I'm not about to let it gather dust in some thief's trophy room. I tracked it to a group of bandits nearby, but I'm no fool. I'd need the white run guards or maybe hire the companions to get it. I don't know why I'm saying this, but if you find it out in your travels, I'd be grateful to you. I can teach you a few things. <laughs> no, friend. That I'm not. But I get along with your kind well enough. No, I'm a Red Guard. My family hails from the Imperial Province. Ah, but I left home when I was just a lad. Been wandering ever since. If you find so that sword, to please bring it to me. So you're wife and daughter. I, I just, just need to hire go one. Home. Maybe. Battleborn, give me your money. It's no fun getting pushed around all the time. Well, I used to sneak out at night and try to tip over the big ox in the Grey Mane's yard. And me and Mila used to climb up on the roof of Dragon's Reach and look for bird's eggs. But I don't do that stuff anymore. Father keeps catching me and then I get in trouble. Until you next time. Ten steps in tomorrow, baby Battleborn. I'm gonna bloody your nose and your lip. Boys, no, please. girls, dogs. Elders, there's nobody I'll I give you ten fight. septums tomorrow. Just don't hit me. Someone oh, do something! I'm being attacked! Yeah.
Nothing like a good adventure or romance to lose yourself in. I import books whenever I can. Most books are too bawdy and violent for my taste. We are the children of man. There's a routine. You have come. You have come to hear the word of Talos. Because the so-called emperor is a coward. That's right. I said coward. Oh, yes. He agreed to banish the worship of Talos at the tip of an Aldmeri sword. They called it the White Gold Concordant. Well... I call it blasphemy. A true son of the Empire would never have turned his back on our greatest hero. Not at any price. Well, let me tell you something, friend. Cyrodiil is a long way from here. And in Skyrim, we will never forsake mighty Talos. <laughs> let them come. I have no fear. For Talos is my ally, and I am his prophet. His word is upon my lips, his voice in my throat. Hello, my friend. If you seek knowledge about mighty Talos, you have most certainly come to the right person. In mortal life, Talos was a Nord. Possessed of unmatched tactical skill, limitless wisdom, and the power to see into men's hearts. Talos mastered the power of the voice, and with it he united the lands of men into a great empire. In southern lands, he was known by the name Tiber Septim. Here in Skyrim, we honor him by his proper Nord name. So great was his reign in life. When he ascended to the heavens, he was made Lord of the Divines. If you want to know more, I'm sure you can find any number of tomes on the subject. The very idea is in.